All right, hello, and welcome back to the Lonesome Road, everyone. Right now, me and Ede, or Eddie, sorry, but I prefer Ede. I think it's female. Holy shit! What the fuck happened here? These are ghouls, though. the terminal. Hold on. Let me switch over to a different uh, item. See if it does better. Alier. Oh yeah, that's just better against robots for sure. <coughs> Alright, more dead sentry bots. Man, they're giving me 5mm. That's gonna be useful. Is this the way out? Doesn't look like it. That guy turned off. Two of these guys are turned off. Harmonica. He was a U.S. Army general. Looks like he got turned into a ghoul, but he was still alive. Or did he kill himself? Interesting. All right. <coughs> I guess it's time to head out. Can go home, Courier. Making your chances coming here. Just like bringing the Lord of Vegas his tribute, bending your knee to old world ghosts. Excuse me? You and that chip deserve each other. Twenty-nine less coins than other traitors have carried, if history's true. Now see the road of the old <coughs> caves. And what the lights of New Vegas promise if they haven't blinded your eyes. What do you mean? Power isn't strength. Power can wall off someone when they believe it's house's power. You've seen the wall, but it's more light than strength. I'm a courier. Courier six. Was career six like you and not like you? You know, spent too many years looking for you. Now letting you come to me. Thought carrying that ship would end you. No, you got lives in you. Hard to kill. Storms, bullets, sand and wind. Yet still you walk. For now. Words are the only way couriers meet. Sometimes it's the paths we walk. But no. We've never spoken. We've never spoken before now. You may not know my voice, but we've walked the same places. The long 15 to Prim. That wasn't the only road you ever walked. I've been to your home. The place you kept returning to. May not be the place you were born. Well, people forget. Couriers can keep communities alive until the day they're gone and their breath catches in their throat. Ulysses. Not my given name. <clears throat> Close enough. Took it from history. Found it in a book. It's an old name. <coughs> Alright. Ulysses lived a long time ago. Had to fight during a time when his world had two flags. And he had to make them one. Ah, Ulysses East Grant. History. Yes. Ulysses walked a hard road. A general, like Caesar and Oliver. He was Brahmin. He led his side to 
victory. Turn two flags into one. Lesson there. If you brought me here to talk, if you wanted to kill me, you would have waited until I came for the ship. No. No, I couldn't. And I'm thinking you can't kill me either. If you did, you'd answer for it. Just as I would. Let the lambs do the killing for you. Killing is personal. So those vows, promises, last bits, more. <clears throat> world would this be if career you've got enough distance ahead of you all right career meant to weigh you down long enough to let death catch up to you there was death in that package and while the chip is important to old world maybe why you found each other little piece of the old world of how close you dodged it with that chip weighing you down promises to keep to others and alive is dangerous enough if I wanted you dead you might be that history needs to have its say the robot with you all of them are machines radios Old world tech reshaped with new hands. Historians. Alright. Couriers. <coughs> seen them as I've walked the divide, tending other machines. It will follow you, obey you, carry. America sleeps ahead of you. Its nightmares filled with quakes. That means waking America's spears up from their slumber. You're resourceful. That machine, robot with you, can help you find the warheads you need to destroy. The way ahead is below. Who are you? You came all this way for answers. Only currency I have. Nothing else to be gained. If history matters to you, you'll need to earn it. Any laws of for now, find the trigger for the warheads buried in Hopeville. Use it. No courier would go to the divide, but you will. And that's what sets us apart. And for you, you'll want to see your home. You're curious. You walk, leave ruin in your path. You can't leave. I don't care if you walk the divide. Turn. If you don't, the divide will come to you. The divide will send its worst against you. It may break you. Road gets rougher from here, courier. They'll lead you to your home one more time. <clears throat> <coughs> oh, I got one more left in me. Good karma. The job. <coughs> the silo. I don't like how he said this shit, but that just means this place is gonna be like hell on earth. Will it be the hardest I've done? Maybe. Maybe so. Better get the assault carbine out. Uh, hold on. There we go.
All right. <clears throat> what up, Ed? Oh man, uh, there's a lot of them then. Already getting sniped at. Motherfuckers. Hiding behind that howitzer, huh? No parking anytime. A lot of random people here. <coughs> All right, I guess we're going inside here, right? Well, we can go inside here. What the fuck kind of weapon is that? Are you using a flag? What the fuck was he using? Thermatic Lee? Thermatic Lance? Oh, okay, we picked that up. Shit. That sucks. Whatever. Motherfuckers be crazy in here. That's a salesman Weekly. Auto duck. That's this commissionary. Oh, <clears throat> by ammo. Oh. Everything I need. Or the millimeter grenade, incendiary, <clears throat> slug rounds, 12.7 hollow point, 12.7, 20 gauge slugs, 10 millimeter rounds, <coughs> 50 caliber, magnum rounds, except a lot of cash, but worthwhile if it takes me a lot farther that new coca cola I wonder if that was ooh, hold on nothing there all right <coughs> tire Codes, today's position. Alright, those will be useful for later. I guess that's it. This, I thought this place would have a little bit more, but nah. It's fine. Make sure I save. Farther to the right. There we go.
your ghoul. The ghoul of five men. Motherfucker's got a grenade launcher or some shit. Must be in the other building. Ah, or above us. Fuck me. Ah, fuck, dude. Dude needs to chill. Oh, you hoe. <coughs> Stop beating on my fucking robot, you asshole. Blade of the West? Jesus, you actually have a fucking sword. Oh, there's something here I need to look at. We go up top. There we go. I see now. Piece of pre-war tech, nuclear warheads. That looks cool. Whoa, that guy exploded. Fucking bastards. <coughs> oh, Eid, get over here. I need you to carry shit. Eid! Oh my god. Bitch, get over here. There you go. Carrying too many weapons in terms of uh, everything I have. Take the arc welder. The cyber dog I'll keep on me. Take the grenades. Take the red, uh, the sonic emitter for now. Alright, that should be good. We should be good for now. <coughs> well, Alright. That'll be it for the Lonesome Room, guys. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please look down below. They come in. And I'll see more shadow location. Anyways, catch you guys later. Peace. I am known by many names. Outslayer. Underlion. The Chocolate Ass. But you... You may call me Tiffany. Uh, is there any more markers around that can stick up my ass?